Hi everyone, it's Peter Hart here. Now Malcolm got in touch recently to ask me to persuade you guys, and especially you girls, to enter his Mayo Mayhem Wave event. Now maybe you're thinking, why would I ruin a perfectly good day's mellow wave sailing by getting all wound up at a competition site? Well, competition, especially in waves, really isn't like that. And one of the best ways to get better at this sport is to go out and do a competition, whether it be racing or waves. In fact, quite often on clinics, towards the end of the day, I'll say, right, it's a wave heat. You've got 20 minutes to get three jumps, three rides, and you just watch the intensity go through the roof. People are laughing and joking. They're going for huge moves. They come in exhausted, exhilarated, and it's just another level. And you'll find, say, if you're going for that first forward and you're teetering on the brink, it's very often the pressure of competition that makes you go for it. Now, you may think you're not competitive, but if you've got this far in windsurfing, then you are, even though it may be only with yourself. If you go out in a heat, if you get through the heat, fantastic. But if you don't, you really won't be disappointed so long as you know you've sailed a good one. And at the end of it, it's not that kind of bitter rivalry where, you know, these fired up races start laying into each other. In the sport of wave sailing, everyone is so mutually supportive. You have a good laugh about it. You'll give each other tips. You'll support each other. And at the end of the day, you'll find yourselves in the pub having the best party of all. So I would be there if I was not in Tyree doing a clinic. Just go and do it and have a great time.